Hello, my name is Amy Santras from the Orangetown Recreation Department and I run the Crafty Creations class on Fridays at 4.45 to 5.45. Welcome to our virtual recreation online class. Today we are going to be making a fire truck out of an egg carton. Let's talk about what you need. We need one egg carton. I have adult scissors and children friendly scissors, some glue, some paint brushes, we need red paint, yellow paint, white paint, black paint, and then we also need some old cardboard from either a pizza box or a Amazon box or any kind of old container and some newspaper that we can put on top of that. That's just to keep everything clean. I also like to have maybe some old towels and a plastic cup with some water in it because we will be doing painting today. We need a couple of straws and some bottle caps. I have Gatorade caps, soda bottle caps, and water bottle. Whatever you have at home. If you do not have these, you can use buttons. Whatever you have will work for this. So let's get started. Oh, we also need a towel paper tube, or a toilet paper tube that we'll be cutting in half and some yarn or some string. So the first thing we're going to do is take our egg carton box and you can let the kids do this just hold their hand so no one gets cut but what we're going to do is we're going to just cut the bottom from the top just like this and you will end up with two separate pieces. Then we're going to take off the side flap like this. And once again, you can work with your child, hold their hands. You cannot mess this up and just cut off the side flap. Put that aside. This is going to be the grill to your car and your ladder that you have. Then we have the insides of this. We just need to snip them off. And you don't have to do anything special. You're just gonna go straight down it. And this probably should be something a parent should do because you don't want your child to get hurt. But we're just snipping it off. Now, these are gonna be used for the top of the fire truck. Here, here, and we have four of them. You can add one to the side. Let your child be creative. I used them as little lights. Your child may think of something else to use them for. You could even use them for the headlights of the fire truck. Whatever the child wants to do, once again, is fine. And paint them whatever color you want. So you're gonna put those aside and your flap aside for the ladder and the grill. Then what you're gonna do is you're gonna paint the entire egg carton red. Now, if your child wants to make a pink fire truck, once again, I like them to use their imagination, but some kids really like a fire truck to be red because that's normally what their color is. So I'm gonna do a switch -o on ya, and presto magic, we have the inside of the fire truck. This does take time to dry. If you wanna pause it and let your child paint the whole thing red and then come back, that's too good too. So here's your painted fire truck. Now you're gonna take the other half of the egg carton. And what we're gonna do is we are gonna cut one side all the way to the edge. Just like this. This is going to be the back of the truck of the fire truck. And this, whoops, is going to be the top of the fire truck like this. So what you're gonna do is you see the inside of both of these? We're gonna cut those out. You don't have to do anything special. Once again, the child can help. You're just gonna cut along the sides and you are gonna end up with these. Now, these I used, you don't necessarily have to but I put one on the side and one inside to hold the ladder and I put one on top of the fire truck. You could even use this for the grill. You decide how you wanna use them. I painted one red, 
one black, and one yellow. So you're going to do that to this side too. This one is a little bit more difficult. You can make a little hole in it and then cut along the side to get it out because you don't want to cut the whole thing out. You just want to cut along the sides of it so you can keep it intact. If, it, if you cut it, you can always glue it back or tape it back together. So once these are out, you notice that now we have two holes. So you can use some paper or some old cardboard and just trace it out like I did here. I made a rectangle and you can just cut that out and glue it on to fit in because this is going to be on the top. So I'm going to show you how I did that. The top is going to be painted red. The sides are going to be white and I just glued a piece of cardboard in there, but you could use regular paper and just paint over it. So this right here will turn into this. Then on this side, same thing. Here's this. And here's it's painted. And then I've already painted one for us. And it can go just like that. And you, I can just take my regular Elmer's glue, just like this, put a little dots on it. Whoops. And go around it like so. And then you have to let all this dry and it just can go right on top. And that's what your, your paper, your old towels are for. You can just wipe them off. So once you have all of this painted, you are then going to take your, your paper towel tube or your toilet paper tube, whichever one you have handy, and you're gonna cut it. And you don't want it that big. This is a great size right here. You need two of this size. So it's like half of the, paper, half of the toilet paper tube is all you're gonna need. This just put aside to use for another time. These are gonna be painted white. So right here, I have a toilet paper tube already painted white. I would just cut this right in half and these are going to be your hoses for your fire truck. And you can wrap string around them or red yarn or yellow yarn, whatever you want to do. And then you're going to paint. This is the side piece to your egg carton. This is this piece right here. And I cut it so that it could look like a um, ladder, or you could cut out cardboard and make your own ladder if you have that handy. Or you could just use colored paper and that works too. So I just painted this white. And once again, you can push pause. And then I, I had, mm, you can use black paint or you can use a black marker and just make lines on it for your for your ladder. The last thing you're going to do is take your Gatorade caps or your soda bottle caps or your water bottle caps and right here, take all that out, you're going to have four tires and I just painted them black. If you want to paint them a different color that's okay and you can either even color the inside of them. If you want to color the inside white that would work too. Now, here's where the parents are going to get involved. You're going to have mom or dad. We used a drill to put this through right here. Or you could take a nail and just hammer a little bit. And you're just making a slight little hole right in the middle of the cap for your um, tires. And then what I did is when you have this all painted and it's dry, much easier when it's dry, if you look what I did, on the front, you're going to make little holes right next to the top, okay? And you're going to do that on each side. Now, you can use anything that is uh, slightly sharp. A parent should do this. You could use um, a nail 
or a uh, sharp pencil would go right through this because once it's through, then you're gonna use a regular drinking straw, just like this. And you're gonna poke it through and you're gonna attach it to the outside once you have a hole in here and then just add a little bit of glue to it and then let those dry so you're going to poke it through and then on the other side you're going to have you're going to go down to the second hole not the first one the second one and it's same place you're going to start poking it through the first part and it's going to go all the way through to the other side so it's going to have to go through this one and then the other side, and then that side, and that side. And once it goes through, you'll see, and then you, you will have to snip off a little bit of the straw so that when you see it, like I painted the straws here and here, and they're black, but I cut them off, so you don't want them sticking out too much, just like that. And then you can decorate the insides of the windows, and then you can do, once you have the, your ladder, you can cut this, and do the grill for the front of the fire truck and you can add either your water bottle or your soda bottle covers to come on top these are soda bottle or you can use you know leftover pieces of your cardboard whatever you want works so once you have all that together and you have your um your uh your tires on you're then just gonna piece everything together and put a little bit of glue and you're gonna put it on top. And this goes down flat, as you can see. And then you're gonna add your um, toilet paper tubes with string or yarn. I used yellow for this one for the hoses and they go in your truck. And I used red for this one, just because I like the color red. But whatever you would have at home, even shoelaces I think would work. And once you've decided what you want to do with these, they can go on top, they can go in the middle, and you can add your ladder to go with it. And if you really wanted to become creative, you could make a little fireman to sit on the top. I did not do that, but I would love to see what your kids would do with this. I think it's a fun project that we could all do together and I would enjoy seeing everything that you guys can do. These videos are being posted on the Orangetown Parks and Recreation Facebook page. We'd love to hear your feedback or even receive a picture of your family participating in our virtual classes. Please send any comments or photos that we can use on our social media page to recreation at orangetown.com. We hope that you and your families are staying home and staying healthy and following the recommendations of our state, county, and local officials, as well as the CDC. These are unprecedented times for all of us. Please remember that each of us play an important role in keeping us all safe. Be well and leave. we look forward to seeing all of you very soon. Thanks, bye.